Listen. Yes. There was a girl with me just now here with me. She's a new here. She was wearing a black t-shirt. Did you see her? No. Actually, she left behind me. I do not know where she is. You must have seen her. No, I did not see her. Didn't you see her? Excuse me. It is okay, thank you. Hi. What have you done? I got upset. Mom, I was just kidding. Were you kidding? I was going to report in the police station. Mom, I was just here. I am sorry. Do not talk to me. Let's go to home. Please listen to me. Let's go. Brother. Yes. I brought almonds for you. Okay, put it here. Where? On my head. Okay, this is a good idea. What are you doing? You asked me to do so. If I ask you to jump in the well, will you do that? Okay, fine. Sorry. Fari, come on. Please start the breakfast. I will bring tea. Call Ashar too. He does not do breakfast before 8 a.m. He follow his diet chart. He is not like you. He follows his chart. Mom, I'm sorry. I will not do that again. Do not talk to me. You also do not talk to me. Then whom should I talk to? I do not have anyone except you in this world. That is why I am apologizing. I am sorry. It is fine, but he should come sit with me for a while. Zaina. Greetings. Greetings to you too. Hello, uncle. Hello, my dear. How are you, dear? I am fine. Zaina, come. Have some breakfast. Thank you, brother. Rubab is getting late for university. Let's go. Fai, Rubab. Yes. Mom, I am coming. Mom, I am coming in a second. Listen to me. Alit Safar has a concert at the university. Will you go? Rubab. Yes. What were you saying? Say it again. I was saying, brother looks handsome. Now stop it. Will you have a bad eye on him? Do I have a bad eye? Okay, I am sorry. Let me cut the onion. Mom, Fai is mad. She is asking me to go to a concert with her. I have denied. 
I will not go. Am I right? Oh. I have asked you to stay away from the chores. Why do you not listen to me? It is bleeding. Let me put the bandage on. This knife is very sharp. Oh, it hurts a lot. Mom, why you are crying? No, it is due to cutting onions. Sorry, I will not go downstairs. I know you do not like it. I am sorry. I never restrained you from going downstairs. I just want you to be in front of my eyes when I am at home with me. When you are not in front of my eyes, I get upset. No, I am here with you. Okay, I will make an armlet. Are you okay? Yes, I am fine. Go. Go, take a rest. Did you come to take this? Yes, I left it in your room. Thank you. Listen. If you get hungry, take food from the fridge, warm it. Do not eat cold. And if you want something. And I know. Do not do any chores. Do not go near the stove. Do not touch the knife. And if you get hungry, open the fridge, warm food in the microwave and eat it. Good girl. Bye. What is this nonsense? I am sorry, I did not say. What do you mean? You have seen me coming. You did it intentionally. Why would I do that? You are my aunt. I do not have any relation with you. You are nothing to me. Okay, fine. I am nothing to you. But let me explain myself for once. There is no need to tell a lie. And by the way, giving wrong justifications is the old habit of this family's men. Listen. Yes. Are you the same boy from the park? Yes. You followed us to home? Yes. Why? Actually, that girl with you. She is my daughter. Okay. I thought she was your sister. By the way, I like her. She is married. Next week she will leave. Will you come? What? Yes. Sorry, I did not know. Do you know it now? If I see you here from now on, I will not spare you. Your seven generations will remember. Did you get me? Now what are you looking at me? Get lost. Aunt. Oh great you have come. I said to you. You did not go to university. No, it was a sports day at the university. And you know, mom does not let me participate in sports. That is why I am at home. She is right. You do not take care of yourself. Do you remember? You got injured in school on a daily basis. You know what? Today I will spend the whole day with you. That is very great. Thank you. 
What is this? Oh, this. I got a cut by a knife. How? I was cutting the onion so it happened. Zena must have scolded you. Yes. Aunt, do you know? I did not get pain from a cut. I got hurt by seeing mom. Mom was crying so, I also cried seeing her. You are the whole world to her. No mother can love like her. You also love your children a lot. Yes, but no one can compete with her. You are right. Aunt, what is this? It is a photo album. This is very old. I have not seen it before. May I? Yes, why not? Aunt, these are very old photos. Is this from your marriage? Yes, from marriage and some other events too. Is this you? You look beautiful just like Manu Abalok. Do not lie. Wow. Is this a Shah? A Shah was not even born when it was taken. Then who is this? Your father. Dad just looks like a Shah. He is not like a Shah, a Shah is like him. A Shah's face cut is very similar to a Shvuk. In fact, their habits are also the same. Who is this in mom's lap? Me. You were not even born at that time. Really? It is a Shah. Oh, it is a Shah. Did mom use to pick a Shah on her lap? Yes, why? No reason. Your mom was a very loving person. But she was a little stubborn. She was not harsh, as she is now. This is a very good picture. I think you should revisit. Okay, madam. And shortlist the candidates. Okay, madam. Dear. Sometimes, take my interviews too. What happened? Will you not ask to sit? I think. You will not ask me to sit. Okay. I will sit on my own. I have to go to the boss cabin. Oh. Your senior has come to your cabin and you will leave him alone. I do not think so. It is a professional behavior. Is there a serious matter? Yes. Important hirings are being done, but you did not discuss anything with me. Or should we say that you did not consider it necessary? Every detail about these hirings is in one file, and that file is on your table for six days. You did not consider it necessary to see it. Yes, I wanted to discuss about that file. I think that we should go outside, have some coffee, and discuss that too. Sorry, I will not go anywhere. Discuss here whatever you want to. Come on, Zaina. You go to official get-togethers. Then, why not with me? Mr. Rashid Qureshi. You are trying at the wrong place. I cannot understand your inconsiderateness. I mean, what is wrong with me? I am a good person. I am from a well-off family. I am your senior and, above all, I am single like you. You are my senior, it does not mean that I bear all of your nonsense. Leave my cabin within a minute. Excuse me. 
You are asking your senior to leave your cabin. You are senior. That is why I was tolerating you but, not now. Will you leave now? Now I will not go anywhere. Let's see. What can you do? What will you do? Will you call the police? Or guards? Come on go ahead. Please. Oh. Where are you going? You said that. You will ask me to leave. Excuse me. Today is not the 1st of April. I hope you are kidding. I am not kidding. And what is the reason? I have some personal reasons. What is the personal reason which I do not know? I have some reasons. You look very stressed. I am keeping this, but I will not approve it. And when you realize, you should not have resigned. You can come back. I will not. I know. You are stressed now. You can take leave for now. Go visit northern areas with rhubarb. Go home. And if you want to go foreign, office will plan it for you. You should go to Dubai. Sorry. I do not want to hurt you. We should meet after two days, but no excuses. If you say a word now I will call Rhubab. Just go and relax. Aunt. Yes, dear. Where is thread and needle? It must be in the box in the cupboard in my room. What will you do with that? Ashar's shirt button is broken, I will replace it. It must be the first button of the collar. Yes. How do you know? It has been his habit since childhood. He breaks the same button. I do not know what he does. He is just like your father. He also used to break the same button. Do not replace it rhubarb. Leave it. Why? My dear your finger got a cut. You should not do chores at my home. Who cares about my hand? What are you saying? My hand is fine now, I am perfectly alright. It does not sound right. But it sounds right to me. But Zena will not like it. She does not ask you to do chores. Do not get worried, she will not know. Okay then go on. You will get me scolded by Zena. the shirt. Yes, sure.
Fai. How long will you see a Shah? Your brother is not that good. Okay, then give me. You can do this. Only you are allowed to do this. No one else can do this. What can you do then? I will take out her eyes before you. What excuse did you make to come into his room? Aunt asked me to replace the Ashar's shirt button, so I came to do that. Whose shirt button? Ashar's shirt. I cannot hear whose shirt button it is. Do I tell you? Yes, tell me. Do I? Okay, go now. I will see this picture. No. Oh God, please let me see my sister-in-law. Rubab. I am coming. Asha. Hi. Where are you going? Me? I'm going to lunch. Will you join me? No. Can you drop me there, please? Of course. Let's go. I am already late. Okay. I have been calling the driver for the last 45 minutes. When he picked up my call, he said I was coming. He has not come till now. He said he is stuck in traffic. Do you know, today is dad's birthday. I have to get a gift for him. I have to gift him today because today is his birthday, but they do not understand. That is why you are being kind to me. Which kindness? that you have chosen me to drop you at the mall otherwise usually at the office we are at a distance you know what why I am distant from you at the office because I am sure if I interact with you you will flirt with me and please do not say that. It is a romance, not a flirt. I was about to say that. It is a romance, not a flirt. I knew that. That is what I told you. Asha, these things do not suit you. You should behave like a mature and decent guy. Okay. If you have some time and if you do not mind, then... There is a Chinese restaurant on the way. Will you have lunch? Oh, Asha. It is not your fault. Your company is not good. Which idiots advise you to impress the girls? No, not all the girls. Just one girl. You. Me? No chance. I challenge you. Challenge. You will express your love before me. जब सांवल मेरे मोड़ मोहार चले हम दिल की बाज़ी हार I think we have arrived. Oh, okay. Here, outside. We have arrived at the mall. See you then. Thank you. I guess you better think of something better. Why? I cannot understand your inconsiderateness. I mean, what is bad about me? I am a good person. I am well off. I am also your senior. And above all, I am single like you. See, uncle has sent a lot of gifts for you. You can count these. Fai. They are not more worthy than you. I like all of these. This one. You use my things more than me. Do not know if dad will come on my birthday or not. 
Why will he not come? He called me today. He is coming soon. Have you told dad that I miss him a lot? I want to meet him and spend time with him. Zaina. Greetings, mom. I know that. You felt bad. I was just. I will not even meet dad. I will not take gifts from him. Leave me alone for some time. I am sorry mom. I did not do it intentionally. Thanks. Do you know? Mr. Arga. Yes, what happened? Nothing happened. He told me about a proposal. For Fari. Did you not tell them she is committed? I told that. She is committed to someone. And she will get married after a few months. Then? It is a good proposal. The guy is settled in the foreign. Family is also good. I was thinking that. We should ask Zayna to consider him for Rubab. What happened to you? Zayna will not marry Rubab. Out of the family. And Asha is also an option for her. She will not agree. Why? Rubab is dear to us. She is my niece. If Zayna does not agree, we will talk to Ishvik. He has the right to make a decision about her daughter. Do you think that? Zayna will accept Ashfaq's decision. Have you asked Ashar about his opinion? Does he accept this proposal or not? He changes the topic whenever I discuss it with him. To him now. Greetings. Greetings to you too. My dear son, we were talking about you. About what? You talk to him. What is the matter about? My dear, how are you doing in your office? All good. 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 Actually, we were talking about your marriage. So, what do you think about Rubab? 
Rhubarb. Not at all. She is a nice girl. You may like her. I do not. What is bad in her? What is good in her? I do not want to talk about it. I do not want to marry. What do you think? Will aunt agree with it? Not at all. You tell about yourself. What do you think of Ruban? Dad, I do not want to marry her. And please do not talk to me about marriage for at least two years. I will tell you if I want to. Hi. Yes. Did you hear? He did not even talk to her properly. I know she is a nice girl. You talk to him. She is from family, we all know her. His life will be set. I am scared that Zayna gets rhubarb committed somewhere else. You talk to her. Okay, I will. Let me have tea peacefully. Yes, brother. Who did this? You? Why would I do that? I do not have leisure time. Then who did this? She did this. Who's she? You are acting as if you do not know. Rubab did this. Why she does this? Go and ask her. Why are you scolding me? She can do it again for you. Tell her to not enter my room. I will never say that. She will get hurt. Okay. Then. I will tackle her on my own. Then do not say that. I hurt her. Brother, why are you offended? Let her do this. After all, she will have to do it. Later on. What? This is not going to happen. Whoever has this misunderstanding, ask her to clear it. Greetings everyone, I am Maya Ali, and I wholeheartedly support Pakistani dramas, so go ahead and subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to like, comment and share this video. You could